Welcome back. Thank you for watching. Today I am going to hopefully finish the backyard. It's been a long, long process. It's probably been two, three month process that I've been doing now. Like I've run into issues and I'm a big procrastinator, so I procrastinate a lot and I have um, just kind of taken my time. Uh, so I've brought in so much dirt, it's not even funny. You guys saw in the last video, you guys saw in the last video how much dirt I brought. Um, in total, I've probably brought in close to uh, 15 cubic yards of dirt. So I've got in, I've used my mom's truck twice. That was uh, four cubic yards. I rented a U-Haul trailer and me and my brother brought in, I believe that's eight cubic yards and then I brought in another two last night um, or yesterday and you guys will kind of see that time lapse uh, at the beginning of when we start this, um, just trying to get that filled in um, but then just finding the time to do it and well not really the time because I've had time if I've just not done it like I should have um, but I did get word that in two to three weeks I have to return back to work for two two days a week uh, which is not bad but you know it's been a year since I've been at work and the dogs have been with me for that year and I need that grass to grow so hopefully it grows in in time if not, I'll probably try talking to my boss to see um, what I can do. Um, if that doesn't work, maybe I'll ask my mom if she could watch the dogs so they don't go out in the back um, until the grass kind of grows in a little bit more. And it's good for them to kind of go. And then after, ho hopefully, I can get cameras up so I can actually kind of watch them too. Um, I've had cameras for three years now that we just never put up, so I'll probably ask my friend to help me with that. Uh, that'll probably be one of the next things I'll do to the house um, besides the shed. Uh, the shed will probably be uh, after the cameras, but I, I just want the cameras up to kind of keep an eye on everything. And then um, my area, I've seen a lot more tagging. I've seen um, people out in almost in front of my house uh, doing drugs. So um, not sure what's going on with that, but. It's always nice to kind of have surveillance of the house and be able to see what's going on when I'm not here. So uh, that'll be next. But right now, just didn't finish leveling it. Uh, so I started doing that in the la at the end of the last video, but I didn't finish because uh, I needed more dirt, of course. So I got that dirt today. Um, there's just big piles over here behind me. Kind of see it. So. Just need to level that out that's where it needed the dirt most um i also have some rocks that i need to keep getting out so me um, and my brother tilled it uh, a few weeks ago more and more rocks still came up so um that's been fun but let's get this started again thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoy
finished. Yesterday, me and my brother, well, mainly me, I leveled everything. I got it um, fairly level, used the board, um, kind of went across, tried to make everything as level as possible. There are still some little divots. Uh, just once the grass grows in, we'll see how it is. If I need to put sand, I'll do sand. Um, it kind of helps it out too. Gives it that, gives it a little bit better feel from what I've heard. I did it yesterday. I finished everything as you guys saw. It took a lot longer than what I wanted to, and it was a lot of bending over, doing a lot of work like that. So um, I was super tired and I'm a little sore still from it. My foot even started hurting. I think from walking around so much. Um, so that was that was that. But um, it came out really nice. So it looks looks pretty level, like I said, but there's still little rivets that I saw. Um, so, or not rivets, uh, a little wavy. Um, but, you know, the best I can do for now, um, especially with just myself, and then kind of in a time crunch to get it done before I had to go back to work. Um, so, so watered it i'm gonna water it again this morning I'll probably water it two times a day yesterday was about 90 today it says it's gonna be closer to 80 and they were saying like the high 70s so that's good and then it's supposed to drop down a little bit more so hopefully that does um stay true and it helps keep the water down it's been a while since i shot those videos that you guys just saw uh, that was back in april it is currently august uh, we just got really lazy and stopped recording and procrastinated. We didn't we didn't edit it, a lot of the videos and they just kind of sat there. So right now I'm just trying to go through everything and get back on track and post some stuff. We've recorded a lot. Uh, we've done a lot since then. Uh, it's been four months since then. So the grass is grown in. Um, I didn't record too much of the grass growing. Um, I had a lot of issues with it. Uh, it took like four weeks for it to actually start sprouting, which I was kind of wondering what was going on. I think the soil temperature was just too low. Um, they kept staying within the 60s. Uh, a lot of what I saw was the soil needed to be, I think, believe it was above 70 for the grass. Uh, I got Bermuda grass. Um, I just bought the Scots uh, turf, uh, Bermuda seed, did that. I'll show you guys what it looks like right now, but there's still some bare spots that I've been trying to, to for it to grow in. I It grew a little bit. There was a bunch of patches that started growing. I would water it. It would... Um, I started getting a bunch of mushrooms, so I'm like trying to fight that and get grass. Uh, some weeds started growing in. So it was a lot of just maintaining and trying to get it to grow in properly. Um, a lot of it has grown in now, so there's just very few bare spots. I'll kind of show you guys that. Um, it does look a little bit uh, dry. Uh, so Carolina and I went to Florida for a week. We went to Walt Disney, so you guys will be seeing that video coming up soon too. But we it wasn't being watered as it should have. Um, and then a few days after that, we went to Laughlin. Um, so it's just, we're just trying to get it to grow back, but it's a lot more green than it was before. It was actually looking really dead and I was scared it wasn't gonna grow back, but it's getting better. I'm watering it about two times a day right now uh, for about 10 minutes each. Um, and then uh, right now it's actually cool. This week has been nice and cool, about 70s. Uh, mid 70s 80s so it's been really good it's it was uh, close to 100 for a few weeks so that was really hard on the grass and um, everything that we were trying to do with it but let me show you guys the grass so over here on the left side you can see there are some bare spots uh, I'm still trying to grow that in everywhere else pretty much grown in there's our dogs Ray loves grass so she's eating it right now but yeah they love the grass so they're constantly rolling in it playing in it so it's I'm glad that we have it um, yeah Ray so that's what she loves, loves to do So 
because all of them do it. It's funny and cool to, to watch them actually love the grass and enjoy it. So it makes it made it really worthwhile while um, all the struggle and everything that I had to go through to get this grass in and um, it helps keep them a lot cleaner. Um, front still really bad there's a lot of dirt up there so they still bring in a bunch of dirt and stuff in the front we're still trying to decide what we want to do thinking of doing more uh, more of a drought friendly landscape up there so a bunch of rocks and stuff like that so once we figure it out and get that going uh, you guys will st see that uh, again we still have to do a bunch of stuff to our house and we bought something that you guys will be seeing coming up soon kind of a big investment there's a lot of work that needs to be done to it but it's something that we will enjoy and will actually allow us to make a few more videos when we go do this stuff so thank you guys again for watching i'm sorry it's been such a long time since we've really done anything and shown you updates for anything that we have planned or had planned we we try not to be as procrastinating as i was before not editing the videos not doing the work that I said I need to do like I buy the stuff and I just let it sit there so in, my, in our office there's a, just a bunch of stuff that needs to be done uh, so you guys will be seeing that coming up uh, hopefully within the next few weeks we could get uh, a lot more going there's still a bunch more that we need to do to the backyard but it's getting there thank you guys for watching we'll see you on the next one Toodles.